Hello, YouTube, and welcome back into some Let's Play Civilization VI. We've decided, uh, we've settled on, uh, there are some great suggestions, of course, as always, uh, but I am pretty darn happy. Now, hold on, we've got to pick the right icon for this. What's the right icon for this? I suppose this, because it kind of looks like a tail, <laughs> and we're going with... <laughs> Although maybe I should spell it ILS given the uh, icon. But we're going with Duct Tails. <laughs> Noah, thank you so much for the 10 months. Welcome on back. It's good to have you here. Hey, TGM. Hope you're having a good day. Loved watching your MP games even though they didn't go your way. I'm glad you, I'm glad you liked it. I'm, I'm glad. Uh, people seem to really enjoy watching it. Still working for an answer. Okay, no worries. Yes, of course you're busy. We don't mean to bother you. <laughs> We appreciate it. I, it was it was just I was like oh I I forgot that that was up in the air still so th thank you all the same Carl it's all good tis all good <laughs> long time YouTube lurker first time Twitch lurker hope all is well hope all is well with you thank you so much welcome in good to have you here um, so religious beliefs here uh, we're gonna go with uh, we're gonna go with work ethic we have some really nice uh, we have some really nice holy sites that plus two plus whatever else you can get around it is pretty sweet. So adding in, let's say, four production per city is solid. Um, that's really the only consideration in this particular game. Uh, back in the day, you would pick reliquaries with uh, with with Jay because you could go pretty crazy on relics. Uh, but that is no longer the case. So we're taking work ethic here. Um, how good are Gurdwaras for us? An extra housing and some more food to just kind of continue the tall stuff makes sense. I could also see stupas working in that spot since we already have like a lot of housing and food, generally speaking, or at least the option for those in our city. And one of the things that we might be lacking are stupas. Um, we could take crusade here, but I don't know that I want to. Cause I want to try the Domri as is. Carl recommended World Church in the stream. That's true. Yeah, any of these that give you uh, economy for followers makes a lot of sense as we are a tall sieve. World Church does seem good. I almost I almost wonder if we should just take cross cultural dialogue because we're 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 going to make up for the culture with our Prasad a bit. <clears throat> and we could get our building later. Yeah, all the yeah, the X follower yield I could see. This th this maybe gets us uh closer to our Domries. I think I think I like this in this spot. And then we could we could evangelize for uh, crusade and our building later on. I think I like dialogue here. Yeah, I think that makes the most sense. So work ethic, cross culture, dialogue, and river goddess. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. Duct tails. Makes me happy. So there's our theology. We can pop that next turn. We could even go for Mahabadi. We are in um, autocracy, so we could try to sneak that through, although I don't have a spot to build it here. We could build it here pretty easily. All right, good timing on some of this stuff, policy-wise and whatnot. That's correct, Mark. Yep. So, like, we have a plus five holy site here, two for the river, and then one for each of those. They still get all of the other typical bonuses. So, we add in five production here. So, our holy site's giving us five food, five production, and five faith. Seems good. Now I'm going to Suze. 
<clears throat> they grabbed this wheat. Um, and we do have our spot for our holy site, so let's go ahead and lock that down. Grab a builder too. Just in case we have shenanigans, I'll bring the other archer down. Need scripture for 10, 10, 10. Heck yeah. I mean, we're about to have it. We are about to have it. We can no more. What was that? Oh, a boat? Do we do farms here? I think we do. We're about to be seven pops, so maybe we should get our... Uh, what are we doing here? Um, should I just try for hanging gardens? We could put in the wonder policy, go for hanging gardens and Mahabadi. I think, I think, I think yes. Does chat ever say no to that question? This is a fair point. That is a fair point. Oracle's still available as well. Um... Do I want to build it here? Does this want to go here? Or here? And then I guess in this spot. <clears throat> so if we do it like this, pyramids is boosting two and hanging gardens is boosting three. If we boost, if we build hanging gardens here, it's only boosting one. If we build it here, it's boosting two. Yeah, I'm gonna raise Bristol is the plan. And I don't really, I still think this government, well, this government plaza is getting worse all the time. I like came in with a plan for it and now like I'm, I'm I'm waffling. By the way, waffles or pancakes, chat? And don't pick wrong or you're banned. <laughs> Neither. Yeah, Belgian waffles are where it's at. I agree with you there for sure. Oh, we need a uh, we need a Prasad. I think we should go settle up here. Russian Bellinis. Mm. Stroop waffles, that's fun. French toast better than either, but waffles are superior to make pancakes. To pancakes, I like waffles over pancakes. I think I do like French toast better, but I just make I make the most ridiculously fatty French toast ever, and it's so good. It's so good. I don't make it very often, but when I do, I emote about it. I think we're going this way.
French toast prepared in a waffle iron. Isn't there a... Isn't there a Simpsons bit? All I can remember is Homer saying, Mmm, waffle runoff. All right, I want to buy all the things. This is only five turns. Interesting, Professor Monkeys. Only remember, mmm, beer. It's when Homer stops going to church. That's right, that's right, because he's wearing, like, it's like a snow day. And it, doesn't he, like, put caramel in there? Oh, my goodness. Homer, when will you learn? Hey, Draco. So we'll build this. Maybe we'll buy their Prasat then, 480. And then we can get started with Mahabadi there. Religion looks like work ethic, cross-cultural dialogue, and um, river goddess as our panth at the moment. Okay, um, what if we go here? It might be where we're going. Is anyone building hanging gardens? I don't have great vision, but not that I can tell. Not that I can tell. Wait a minute. Since when do barbarians make galleys? They always spawn quads. That seems weird. Hmm. Maybe I missed it in an update. Yeah, maybe maybe barb mode changed it. That that would make sense. Hmm. I'll pet your dog. Good. Is there any reason to leave these woods? I mean, we're not doing anything with appeal. Eager, thank you so much. Thank you for the 11 months. Welcome on back. Good to have you here. Because I could just chop this. And then I could make Oracle here. <laughs> I mean, I think we want to farm it anyways. Yeah, I think I think that's fine. Oh. 
Nazca. That has implications. Fable! Thank you so much for the Prime. Welcome back for 27 months. Holy cow, that's a long time. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, and welcome back. Okay. So if we settle the bananas... I can aqueduct here still. I still don't really understand. Can someone explain Eiffel to you? Every time you build it, you see no difference in appeal on your tiles. Um, I mean, are you using the appeal lens? Because it, it adds in... it. You have to own the tile, but it, it, it should improve it by two. And if it's not, then I don't really know what to tell you. <laughs> Pretty much, Hogue. Pretty much. The ascent to the highest story is by stairs. And yeah, I don't know, Pinker. That's weird. By means of which persons appointed expressly for the purpose. Okay, this is a choice wonder for us. And I didn't need to worry about losing it. I also didn't need to worry about rushing it, so that's a thing. I need to get these Prasats online. It's too big of an economy boost. Maybe we settle this? If we put a holy site here, it's plus four and can make a bunch of farms. Eh, I think I still think I like the banana. Yeah, check your mountains. Are they six appeal? That's a great. Do, do your mountains have six appeal? Um, because they should. Normally, mountains are a static four, unalterable, but with Eiffel, they go to six. I mean, I don't I need to buy that next turn, so I can't buy this tile. It's fine, we'll chill for a second. Turn 70, great bath. Boy, the priorit prioritization of that has, uh, <laughs> has really gone down. Because I'm going to aqueduct here anyways. Is why I settled off water. It's not something I typically do. Uh, yeah, can we see the Prasat yields is a great question. No, you can only see the... Um... Because we should have, what, two and a half culture from it? So it's just it's from po it's in the from population river because we're getting four from population. Normally you get what point three culture per per citizen. 
And instead, we're getting 0.8, and we have five. So yeah, so four from population. So it's just it's it's hidden within the uh, population po portion of this one. Religion looks like this: Blue Wings, work ethic, cross cultural dialogue, and River Goddess so far. What's up, Rock Hopper? <laughs> they are fun. I'm enjoying this so far. I, I I don't know about this war that I want to get to. But we'll see. And yeah, I, I I wanted to do a long stream today. That's also plus four. This is just better though. Does Void Singers all well, Void Singers works off of faith, right? And we have good faith, so I guess I, I mean, currently the void is only giving us four faith from our old god obelisks. But the rest of it just works on faith gen, and we have that. We've got that in droves. Twenty. Okay. What's up, CL? Everything has its limit. Okay, and then military engineering afterwards. It's nice to be streaming this late. I actually prioritized eating today, so I'm I'm feeling fine. Yeah, I want to get to engineering too. I was thinking about trying to sue's uh, Valletta. Like, if we if we go to recorded history, we grab the governor title, we take Amani, um, send Amani to Valletta, faith by walls, then we can get there. Also, love seeing on a bit, a little bit later. Nice. I, I I hope that most of the rest of the year will will include some 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 healthy healthy streams. Lengthwise and all that. Do, do, do. On this, Cavets Miss Grancio Tats, President of Grancio Tats. I see come roads us, my goodness, Pendidas and Unvergel. Probably not, T-Rex. I have D&D &D later. I don't think I can I don't think I can play for all that much longer. Building block 
folks have I've lived through some I I have not had issues with the launcher. I I've I've heard that complaint from people. Could also grab a researcher here. I really want to get the aqueducts online. I I think I like this play a good bit. <laughs> Dirk Krieger, thank you. That's that's good. What's my character in D and D? Uh, tonight it's a cut. Like I started as a Tempest cleric, um, and then we've recently uh, just created a custom domain. I was a uh, a Tempest cleric obsessed with Saloon, the Moon Goddess, uh, and so now I have come up with the class of a Radiant cleric, and it's all custom at this point. See Ignasi. That's true, GD. I did. I did that. that <laughs> I see salt. How are you, friend? I, I did technically start as an arcane cleric, but that didn't. Uh, that 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 didn't take as it as it were. <laughs> how are you? How are you feeling, sea salt? I hope you're doing all right. All right, what are we doing? Uh, we are building a wonder, so this is useful. Do I run around showing people my moon to demonstrate my faith? No, no, I, I haven't. But you've given me wonderful ideas for uh, for, for what the symbol of, of the church I want to found should be. <laughs> Just a butt. I, I I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> I'm glad you're doing a little bit better. Are we settling more cities? We're always settling more cities, I think, in this game. Do I need discipline? I don't think so. It's just two gold per turn. This seems fine. You're okay. I'm sorry you're having an issue, sailor. Work that one. Prasat on the way. We have faith. Which I'm going to need for walls. Boo. How are amenities doing? They've neutralized. Pretty sure there's still a goodie hut over here, so let's go grab that. Two turns on this Prasad, and then we get five culture and a bunch more faith. Look at our faith already. Great library to Cleo. That, I mean, but you're not going to help. You're so far away. This is a debate. Mapuchi. Dude. This is a debate. You're debating me. You're not going to help with this war. You're super far away. How dare you. How many cities would you aim to settle in a tall civ like Khmer? I mean, it's still... The answer is still as many as you can. I, I think... I mean, I've done... Man, back in like vanilla Georgia, we did a four city Georgia game, tall Georgia game. I think a four city challenge sounds fun to me with this. With this sieve. I don't know what the win con would be, but it, it sounds fun. Oh, 
Are one city challenges viable? Depends what you're trying to do with it, I would say. Like, I, I think you can win a one city faith race pretty easily. Um, tall science sounds interesting. But one city challenges feel pretty bad in Civ 6. I've done them many times, or at least attempted them many times. And, uh, yeah, they feel pretty bad. So 10 food, 10 production, and 10 faith from this holy site. Oracle, Apadana? Or just start building military? Got a nice theater square. Government plaza? Really play religious, but in your game, uh, looks like you're doing it. What should you go for in the Civic Street? What are the best middle and late game religious ones? Every time I'm in a religious game, the strategy is as follows. Worm Slug. Hey, thank you so much for the three months, and thank you for the value for value. Don't catch many live on here, mostly on the YouTubes. Keep up the good work. Thank you so much. Thanks for taking the time to drop by your Prime sub. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. In 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 religious victory games, you're basically you're you're looking to get scripture, you're looking to get uh simultaneum, and you're looking to get to theocracy. And that's pretty much the end of the game, at least for the ones that I uh that I go for. Like I it, even if I get to like democracy, I don't switch into it for the discount. You can, but Oracle or Apadana? We've already built several wonders, so Apadana feels a little bit worse. So we could try for Oracle. I think I want to try to chop out Mahabadi up here. Yeah, no, that's pretty much it. <laughs> that's pretty much the whole thing. So did this go dormant already? No, it says it's active. It just doesn't, it's not smoking. This one erupted too and is not smoking. Are volcanoes bugged? What sieve would I advise for a beginner aiming for domination? Except, uh, I mean, Rome is my go-to domination uh, recommendation. But, um... If you don't want to play Rome, I would try the new Shaka. If you enjoy messing with uh, cores and armies. Yeah, um, Ottomans are great if you want to do a Renaissance War. That, that's probably a great one to practice. All right. Oh, Alexander is a great one too. Yeah, if you're if you're looking to if you're looking to uh do some early on shenanigans, then yeah, absolutely. Alex is a terrific choice. Governor title available. I think it's time for researcher. Yeah, Colombia is quite good as well. Favorites for culture victory. Um, I really like Persia. I like P2. 
Peter, obviously. Um, I don't know, man. Every Civ is a good culture Civ if you build wonders. <laughs> the Greeks, I think Pericles is one of the best. Ethiopia is great for culture, yeah. Join your first online game tonight. Nice. <laughs> well done, Wormslug. Congratulations to you. That's great news. Are we... No, next turn. All right, so let's see what tiles they get. They're going to probably take the iron and a tutu. They took gypsum, so that maybe they don't see this yet. Took gypsum and a rice tile. That That's quite all right with me. Quite all right with me. Spend some faith here. I generally don't conquer city-states. Um, I find the economy tends to be valuable. Um, yeah, I, I usually don't. And we put ones in this game that we that I think are good. So I won't be conquering any city-states today. Diplo favor is whatever. So aqueducts next turn. Turn 80. That might be worth starting a war over. We have 10 turns on the arrow. We've already secured our golden age. And we're about to get two more wonders. So we're going to go well over on era score per usual. If I build it here, we get a farm triangle. Which is a similar effect. I mean, it would affect this one. Eh, I think I like this still. How long? 13 turns, 97 production. Oh, you poor industrial zone lovers. Looking back at the Invitational uh, Tournament, am I looking forward to doing another? Yes, absolutely, uh, Bazooka. I'm, I would love to do another Invitational Tournament like that. That would be quite all right with me. Uh, and what changes would I make, if any? I would, I would have better neighbors and land and meet city-states. Those would be my changes. <laughs> Is Congo the one that gets food and gold and other stuff per relic and other great works? Yeah, it's uh, per, per relic, per sculpture, and per artifact. Is Congo. Yeah, I would have oil. I would have strategic resources if I were to do it all over again. <laughs> Congo's fun. Um, you can, yeah, any of those swords that have been buffed in this last patch seem fun. So you could use Congo sword for sure. Okay, so. Yeah, it was pretty, the BBS city state distribution was just, I mean, it, it, it decided the game, right? Pretty much. 
all of those RNG factors did. And we talked about this a lot. Like it's it's good that those are there. You need those fa factors to exist to make to make Civ you know perpetually interesting and stuff. Uh, but but what sucks about it in a competitive situation is like you know committing four four to six hours to something where you've low rolled. You know. We talked about that a good bit earlier in the week. I don't need to buy a horse. Where did you come from? Where is this barb? Is this seriously from this? I have issue with the fact that the city states just ignore barbarian or all, like the civs just bar ignore barbarian stuff because I'm fairly certain this one that's been here literally the whole game is now my problem even though I'm 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 17 tiles from it he's 2 tiles from it and he's 3 That irks me. This always irks me. But I don't want to buy like a horse here. I'll just, I guess I'll just buy walls. Oh well, it, wait. Maybe it was a maybe it was an errant one because it suicided. So um, maybe that whole rant was un unnecessary. Uh, Jewel, thank you for the follow. Welcome. In a dusty, bustling corner of the Indian state of Bihar. There's We're not going to evangelize until next era, though. That one might think of as the hub of Buddhism. Yeah, they didn't pet the dog. <laughs> uh, did I enjoy Bioshock Three? Uh, yeah, I did. It wasn't. <sighs> It didn't quite have the same feel as like Bioshock 1, but I liked it better than 2. I definitely liked it better than 2. Let's get that done. Is that infinite? Yeah, that's infinite, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's I, I, We're on the same page. I knew what you meant. But I liked it. I, I I thought a lot of people didn't like it, which I thought was stupid. But no, I, I certainly enjoyed it. I still want to fight England. It's getting a little late, but maybe it's not if we use our Domery into like the mid-tier war. I have to get used to the new timings of the game and stuff. So... It'll be interesting, and we're going to once again go way over on Era Score. That's all good. <laughs> Should we play the Bioshock series? It's it's not a bad idea. Is this better to start with? Maybe. Maybe. Oh my god. 20 turns to build an aqueduct. 20 turns for two housing? Stonehenge. Do a let's play on a single player game like Bioshock? Yeah, I uh I I I guess it depends on when Valheim comes out. Because I I would like I would like for my first soiree into the uh, you know more let's plays of non civ stuff. 
I would love it to be Valheim. Um, well, it's six housing for that city, yes, but typically it's two. But uh, I, I, I definitely want to cross that threshold of doing more stuff. And YouTube's a nice, easy place to sort of practice, because if I record it offline, then there's just kind of no pressure. You throw it out into the world, and hopefully people like it, and if not, whatever. Playing Bioshock and doing crossreads of Ayn Rand. No one should read Ayn Rand. And I'll stand by that. Nobody should read that nonsense. On the swift ship in the form of the taxpayer. That's someone. Okay. Just casual wonder spamming. What if you want a third grader's understanding of economics? Then go to third grade. <laughs> you always assumed I was a hardcore anti-capitalism libertarian. No idea why. No, I am not. No, I am not. You'd insult third graders, lol. Low, low, low. Have I ever done a marathon speed game on stream? No. No. Um, they, they, they're, they're, they're wildly unpopular for content creators. The, the, the popular half of the game is the first half. Um, and so the slower and longer things go, it just it's just a grind fest. So, okay. Now where are we at? I have to say thanks for introducing me to the Brandon Sanderson books. We were just talking about them earlier in the stream, Worm. Kept you occupied during offshore working. Nice. That's a, it's a, good, it's a good place to, to kind of fill the void, I would imagine. And, and no, I am not an anti-capitalist. <clears throat> I am not a capitalist, but I am not an anti-capitalist. Um, yeah, you're welcome. I'm glad you enjoyed them. And I, wait, I thought, wait, don't libertarians love capitalism? I don't know a lot about libertarians, other than I generally haven't enjoyed my conversations with people who have identified as such. I thought I thought libertarians loved capitalism. I thought they like worshipped capitalism. I'm I'm a I if if I were to self describe as anything, I would say that I'm I'm like a humanist. <laughs> like I, I really like I really like our species, and I would like our species to thrive. And that apparently is controversial, <laughs> if you start to look at policies and stuff. But I, I I'm a big fan of the human race, and I I would like all people to be happy and healthy and. Live long, productive lives. They want all the same things as Republicans, but with legalized drugs. <laughs> I'm a Trekkie. Yeah, uh, yeah. I just like I like human beings. I like people. I like you. I like you. All of you. I love you. You're wonderful. I want you to be happy and healthy. That's all. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> I think with that, we're actually due for a cut in the video. Let's go ahead and do that. This might be the start of our war, to be sure. Our economy is catching up quite nicely. I will say that we're getting a lot, a lot of faith out of this stuff. Like, yes, we have a couple nice holy sites, but we have no, we have no business making this type of uh, faith per turn, and I love it. Oh, I guess part of that's void. Uh, eh, 
a good chunk of that's void. But still, we're doing well. We're going to get our aqueduct, so we're going to get even more faith because the population will, will kick in. Um, and yeah, we'll go from there. So thank you so much. If you've been watching over on YouTube, I do appreciate it. Don't forget to stop by twitch.tv slash thegamemechanic and come join us live in person on the internet.